Have you ever pondered the intricacies of the McGinty equation? It's a fascinating topic that delves into the heart of theoretical physics. The story begins with the Lagrangian density formulation. This cornerstone of theoretical physics is a compact mathematical description of a physical system. In the McGinty equation, the Lagrangian density is constructed by considering various fields and their derivatives in space-time. This formulation encapsulates the energy of the system, including potential terms and interactions, which then allows the derivation of the equations of motion. Moving on, the Euler-Lagrange equations come into the picture. These are born from the principle of stationary action, a fundamental concept in classical and quantum mechanics. This principle posits that the true path of a physical system is one where the action functional, the integral of the Lagrangian density over space-time, is stationary. This leads to a set of partial differential equations known as the Euler-Lagrange equations governing the behavior of the fields. Next, we transition from the classical to the quantum realm through the process of quantization. In this procedure, the fields of the McGinty equation are promoted to operators, with their canonical conjugate momenta also becoming operator valued. This transition is accompanied by the imposition of commutation relations to account for the inherent uncertainty and discreteness of quantum systems. Solving these quantum field equations can be a complex task, especially when considering systems with non-trivial interactions or potential terms. Analytical solutions are often limited to highly symmetric or simplified cases. For more challenging scenarios, numerical methods become crucial. These solutions shed light on the possible states of the quantum system, their energies, and their evolution over time. Interactions and perturbations are then introduced to the Lagrangian density to account for additional physical effects beyond the free theory. These terms may represent forces between particles, external potentials, or, in the case of the modified McGinty equation, the perturbative effects of gravity. This step is essential for extending the applicability of the model to describe a wider range of physical phenomena. Finally, we come to the derivation of solutions for specific cases. This may involve considering limiting cases, such as the well-understood regime of free quantum field theory or specific perturbative scenarios. In summary, the journey through the McGinty equation is a thrilling exploration of theoretical physics. It starts with the Lagrangian density formulation, moves through the Euler-Lagrange equations, and the process of quantization involves the solving of quantum field equations, incorporates interactions and perturbations, and finally results in solutions for specific cases. Each step is a crucial part of understanding and applying this fundamental equation in theoretical physics.